Hey guys, so tonight is the Supernatural mid-season finale. We have had a lot of fun monster episodes um, that have been amusing. Uh, we haven't had Cass, we haven't had Crowley around too much. What happens usually is that they give you a fun monster episode and then they give you like a really horrible, depressing um, arc episode. And we've had a lot of super fun monster episodes, which leads me to believe that tonight's arc episode, since we know Cass is coming back and Crowley is coming back and they're all going to be reunited and we've seen the trailer where Dean like asked Cass to, you know, um, that it's going to be horrible and it's going to be really upsetting. I am prepared, maybe, for um, the devastation that is to come. So... My thoughts on tonight's episode, what I think we're going to happen, Cass isn't going to actually Dean and, you know, Sam's going to step in or Cass is going to say, no, you're my family, you know, and family being a big thing. See a recurrence of the theme with Sam where Sam, you know, is really feeling that being a monster is a choice and that Dean's going to be able to make that choice. Uh, Dean doesn't seem to believe that he can. I do think that the mark of Cain is going to rear its head and we're going to see um, that Dean's really been maybe controlling it and there's going to be a point where he can't anymore. Oh! Mama! I forgot! Mama! Yes, that's, uh, that's... <clears throat> that's right. <laughs> what? An emergency is a dead body, okay? Or, or a wigged out angel, or the apocalypse. Take three. In honor of Crowley's return, nice scotch. Pinky up, because I'm a lady. Mother. Fergus. Crowley. <laughs> Must be your mother. They'll always love you. You know, John Winters is not going to let her eat number one dad awards. No, Say the least. I know. No. That's where the Ramones and Blondie got their start. John freaking Winchester. John freaking Winchester. He saved you. Don't be as dumb as you look. Tell me you had to do this. I did. I didn't mean to. No. Tell me it was them or you. Again, at the very end, we see Sam trying so hard to believe in Dean. And it's, it's his faith in Dean that I think is going to be what ultimately saves Dean because I think by the end, Dean will be saved and I think it's going to be Sam's faith in him that does it. Is the mark taking him back over? Is he turning into a demon? We saw the commercial for, you know, the next one in January and Metatron seems very happy and excited by the foaming in the mouth crazy Dean. But I think his salvation, his ultimate salvation is going to come from Sam. And I mean, I mean, that's what the this, this story is. I mean, that's supernatural, is that the brothers saving each other. The look on Cass's face, the horror, um, the realization that he might actually have to. Dean. Overall, not an extremely upsetting episode. I feel like it really is just setting up everything for next half of the season. So we see Metatron in the chair in the Minna Letters bunker that we've seen Crowley in before. So I don't know... Um, what that was, so they brought him down from heaven to try to fix this. One of the most exciting bits in the trailer for me was that Charlie was in it. But Charlie seemed to really like Killer Dean, so I don't know if it's like something weird about Charlie. Overall, I mean, it wasn't like a heartbreaking episode, although the end was really sad to see Dean in that, that place. So that was the mid-season finale. Uh, if you want to hear me talk about more things, um, you can subscribe to my page and do that right there. Uh, and, uh, I guess I'll see you guys in January.